of time. Coming over the middle. Complete to Le'Veon Bell. And Bell, big collision close to the five-yard line. At that time, they weren't able to get any pressure. Gave Ben Roethlisberger plenty of time to get that ball. Falls to the air again. Gurley out of the backfield. Gurley's got a lot of room at the 25. Jumps over and trail roll. A gain of 31 for Todd Gurley. Complete blow by the Bears. That's the third consecutive play action. Here's Murray with some room. Hurdles a tackler. What a catch and run by Murray as he went over Brandon Carr. Just right now, he wants the ball in his hands. He wants to inflict punishment. You see the job that he does here going over the top of Brandon Carr. Take what the defense gives you, and they give you a flat. Nice. Bernard Pierce oh. jumps over one defender and gets down to the, about the four-yard line. They're not going to take the field goal and instead try to put six, seven, or eight. For the Browns on the Ravens, here is Devin Hester out of the end zone. Hester leaping across the 25, down the sideline. Hester breaks his first big one as a Baltimore Raven across the 45. Kick returner, Devin Hester. There's no disputing that. You're right about that. All-time best and it, another, a, a great signing by the Baltimore Ravens and John Harbaugh. John Harbaugh, a special teams coach. Now he's got a guy to add another weapon to the array. Be pressured. Let's it fly to Gurley, leapfrogs one defender, flags all over the place in a second there. Watch his head go down right there, excuse me, that's 29, Kendall Fuller. See his head go down and look away, and that gives the Gurley, a great athlete, the ability to leapfrog him. Goff looking to Gurley. And he will leapfrog a defender, and that is a touchdown! Oh my goodness for Gurley! And give us assist to Derek Carrier, number 86, who gets the block, stealing out the inside defender. Breland tried to wrap up, but the first thing he does, his eyes go to the ground. So when you lower your eyes to your target, much like catching a football, you got a chance to whiff. And you know the scouting report says number 30 can run the high. From the pocket again, across the middle, Gronkowski hurtling down all the way to the Broncos 27 portal. Throwing out to the side. This is Yeldon. Yeldon gets the first down. Blake Bortles looking out to his left, and the check down over the middle makes Yeldon spin all the way around. And then he leapfrogged. On second and four, Todd Gurley will break through. Gurley, high hurdling. Todd Gurley is amazing. Special player. Earl Thomas, one of the best players in the league. Every year from the 29-yard line. Peterson. Elliot to the action. Wow, look at that. <laughs> well, we talked about. Here he comes. Check this out. And guys are going to go low at the knees. And then we already saw the film. There it is. We knew what he was going to do. Cleared with ease. A very exciting young player. An exciting young team at this point. And, you know, Aaron Rodgers is a great quarterback. That's not going to change. Do you have spurts where you don't play as well? Sure. And then you press. I don't know, but I mean, the guy's a great quarterback. And, and I mean, that, I mean that's fine. Back to the Philly 43. Elliott now to the outside. Gets around the corner. Gets by McElvin. Not to mention, at the end of this run, he's going to do another one of these hurdle moves. But there was no way Leotis McKelvin thought that he was going to get outside of him where he was, and yet he has the power to run inside, the speed. Like a shield, eventually if you keep attacking it, you will break the shield. On first down, Prescott. Check it down to Elliott. Hurdles! Elliott out of bounds. He went over 5'9", Tavon Young. That tremendous athletic move right there. Three solid plays in a row now for Zeke Elliott. Spectacular one there. To make it a six-point game. Look at Collins leaping over that. Of course, the ball would be in play now under the new rules, but it's out of bounds. A long jump at the combine. Look at this. We first saw this with Cam Chancellor, I believe it was, with Seattle in the playoffs maybe a year ago. If he makes contact with any of those offensive linemen, then I think it's a foul, but since he cleared everything, which of course he can do. 35 yarder, up and good.
But hang on, we get a penalty. Camp Chancellor jumped about 12 feet in the air. <laughs> and almost blocked that thing. That ball go through him? <laughs> he did. He gets back there and he blocks it. It's wide. Did he get a piece of it? Unbelievable. We get a penalty, too. Timeouts left in the half for the Hawks. Wilson out throwing to Jimmy Graham. Oh. Up and over for a first down and more. How healthy is Jimmy Graham? Leg. He's going to catch his ball in the flat and jump right over Stephon Gilmore. Unbelievable. He made a one-handed touchdown catch. And he looks like he's... Treatment. They've started the foundation to help other families in a similar situation pay for all their medical needs. Wow, look at Stewart leaping and then staying on his feet and picking up the first down. How about that vision and cut back ability? And what's the finish by Jonathan Stewart? Give it to Lacey. Big running room for Eddie Lacey. Leapfrogs a defender and he's inside the 30. Look at the big fella. And then Justin Durant or just simply overruns it. Excuse me. Damian Wilson overruns it and Eddie Lacey showing, showing that. Touchdown, Giants!